Hey, 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 Scott here. Well, we're uh, going to do something a little different. Uh, I am going to take a shot at doing a review. Uh, Saker has sent me their little mini chainsaw. Well, you know what, guys? Being disabled, I had to, with my neck, I can't lift my big chainsaw anymore. So, it's over at the farm with Rob. So, whenever Saker said, can you review, because of your neck and whatever, the little chainsaw, I'm like, I'll give it a shot. I've, so the last week or so, um, it was sent to me, I guess, actually, while I was in Oklahoma, it was sent to me at the, haha, <laughs> Met America. Hey, it almost like I set that up. I didn't. I'm not smart enough for that. So, see how my little hedge here is a little all over the place. I'm going to put it to work. We have anywhere from one inch through to about three inch. Um, battery life. I seems to be okay. Um, I'm surprised at the longevity of the battery. And the I, I do see what the only fault I can find with it is if you were left-handed, right-handed, you press it, no problem. But it would be very awkward. Now, I don't have a problem with it because I press it with, I got big enough fingers that I can press it. Or I run it like that. But... I could see how it would be a bit difficult to do if you were constantly using it left-handed. I'm right-handed, so it works for me. But my son is left-handed. And he said that it did, he did find it a bit cumbersome. Um, he he did like it um so yeah we're gonna go over set it up and uh we'll see how quick it goes through this the uh wood and uh eh, i might even cut the grass while i'm doing it we'll see you in a minute What's going on in here? Huh. Funny. Find you guys sitting in the bush. Always, always, always wear eye protection when working with saw cutting. You can, I, I actually, family friend was splitting a piece of wood. Well, he lost an eye. Don't forget, always stay hydrated.
See how easy that was? Love it. Absolutely love it. Yes, they did send this to me. It is a sponsorship. But I can't thank them enough. I couldn't do that with a real chainsaw because of my neck and the weight. This is, I'm going to say at the most, it's four pounds, three pounds. And it's got a great little grip. Perfect. Uh, you know, it's got, it's got the uh, protector. And you know what? You don't have to worry about special oil. This here will run off of canora oil. Whatever you got in your kitchen. They send you a little vial and I'll, I'll show all that later. But they, they send you a little vial. And guys, amazing. And it also opens up. Those are all raspberry plants. Is it sharp? Well, yeah, you saw me cutting through all of it cut through like butter. I do prefer it be a little sharper. Personal preference. Is it sharp enough the way it is? Absolutely. Hopefully the wind is not uh, interrupting or, or you can't hear a whole lot of wind, but you guys see by the trees behind me, it's, well, it's a nice day here. You guys fell over. So, we will just kind of turn you up. And of course, just before I made this, yeah, that's right, I broke it. So, it's with a little tender loving care. So anybody wants to sponsor me on a really good uh, tripod, that'd be wonderful. Because in the making of this video, yes, a tripod was injured. Now, this is where I stop because poison ivy's here and I'm in shorts. I don't like poison ivy. Now, that's a half decent piece. Well, it pretty much takes just over the, just over the saw, but you know what? It's still, it got the job done. So, it, uh, so far so good. Now, let's go for a drive. Now, everybody, make sure you're seated. No jumping around the back of the truck. That's why you're going to fall and get hurt. No. Because I would have to take you to the next township, throw you off there, so that my township didn't get billed for, you know, your medical. Just saying. Anyways, let's go for a drive.
Uh oh. Look at you guys. I can't even take you anywhere. Can't even take you folks anywhere and you're all over. Not sure what happened there. Now there's a good thumbnail. Hey, 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 well, I didn't get it all done, guys, but I can only do a little bit at a time. But look at the difference. From there, right through to there, because the poison ivy started right there. I don't do poison ivy. We're just not friends. Um, I believe the unit they sent me was just uh, just under a hundred. Um, so I honestly I've wasted more money on crazier stuff. So <clears throat> it's still got. Full charge. I've ran it for at least an hour with the trigger taped. Plus I did all that, which took me, I don't know, 45 minutes, an hour. I know it seemed like it'd take me 10 minutes by the video, if that. But, um, due to my neck and back, <clears throat> I can only do for a couple minutes and then I had to come up and have a seat. And then the inspector came out and said, well, you missed a spot. But uh, I gotta say, um, there's always gotta be cons. Nothing's perfect in this world. To me anyways, except for my wife. Ah, I'll have to make sure she watches this one. 
Um, but anyways, <clears throat> they should make it somehow dual that you can use it right-handed or left-handed, and you can. I, I used it with my left hand as well, but it's very cumbersome. Come, whew. Big Mike, look what you did to me. Um, cumbersome. And it, it was awkward. Um, the weight was great. Um, I really like that you can use any type of oil you have, vegetable, canora. Um, I, I don't know what oil they send you, but they do send you with a little bottle, uh, which you can refill, uh, send you with all the tools. Um, is the version with two batteries better? I did quite a bit of work with it over the course of the last couple days. And I'm going to say that battery is still strong. So <clears throat> two batteries, it would be a luxury. If you were going like out to a hunt camp or something and you were going to be out there, but normally if you're going out to a facility like that, you're, you're running gas engines. You're not running battery operated, you know, two pound chainsaws. Um, <clears throat> other than that, uh, it's a win-win. And as part of Jesse and I's uh, 30 cabin giveaway, we're going to be giving one of these away. Uh, so, thank you, Saker. Um, thank you uh, to the rep that I've been dealing with. Um, customer service is top-notch. And that is a huge thing for me. If you've got good customer service, you've got a repeat customer with me. You may have not the strongest product, but if I put you up against another and your customer service is 10 times what theirs is, I'll be going with customer service every day. But anyways, guys, I'm going to cut it off here and uh, go try to uh, put this all together. So thank you, Saker. Um, and it's two thumbs up for me. Um, great product. I did drop it a couple times. Um, nothing broke nothing cracked um i can see the chain guard if you were to take that on a big hit but again it's not meant to be working in the bush it's to be meant that trimming my tree here to keep it up so i don't hit my head um on the branches whenever I've got the lawn tractor out, you know, over there. I don't know when those raspberries have seen sun last. I'm expecting a bumper crop of raspberries this year because you've got good water and now it's got sun. So we'll see how they go. And uh, anyways, I'm just rambling on now. Hence the name. Take care, guys. God bless. And uh, talk to you on Thursday.